Halloween treats, recipes, and crafts for the whole family. So, like after <laughs> seeing a few of like different types of like craft books, like I kind of like see or like similar stuff <laughs> already. So, and like whispers of hair. <laughs> So, kit tips for cooking and crafting, you got, um, and, like, basic kind of, like, introduction to, um, the book. And, so you got, like, Halloween anticipations, recipes and crafts for pre-Halloween fun, and some of them are just, like, one page and some are like right after the other like these two so so you'll have like what like the ingredients are and then so you get like a kind of like introduction or kind of like random not random but like some information here and then how much it makes and how to make it this one has like uh, variations to it so roasted pumpkin seeds so like variations of it and then you got halloween crunch mix maple cider punch so and like how to make those so this would be like the basic setup for all like the recipes like a few like a few of them have like photos like this one is um baked sweet potato chips so you have like an image of like how you could present them and like for this one you got like marshmallow like hot cocoa marshmallow kind of thing so and like it's basically on how to make like the marshmallow parts and so they got like how to how to carve a jack-o-lantern um carve a squash um like indian corn bracelets trick-or-treat basket uh, flying ghosts, so like a few crafts that you could do beforehand. Halloween hand warmers, leaf lanterns, and like for the crafts, it's a basic same setup as like the recipes, like what you would need and like how to make it. And so, um, enchantments, so like on the day of kind of thing so black risotto um warm red cabbage slaw cabbage slaw with apples curried pumpkin soup so it's a few different meals that you could do like if you're doing like a adult only kind of halloween party um like I'm sure like some um, some of these like kids would like as well like to bring to school or something and then you got like decorations um, napkin rings and then you got Halloween excitement recipes and crafts for sweets and treats so again it's mainly one right after the other and the same kind of setup um, and again a few random photos here and there and so it's more of recipes to me with a few crafts flown in. Now this, um, these decorations are edible. So um, stained glass spooks. So it's just like melted down hard candy into these, which you could eat later on. So for me, this is more of a recipe book with a few crafts slash decor pieces thrown in so but still can be um, useful helpful to give you ideas of what you could do um, before Halloween or on Halloween so yeah Halloween treats a holiday celebration book by Danita Mickey Pinto I am Hoping I'm saying that name right, but yeah, happy readings.